welcome back today I thought that we could do some cleaning together I really need to take care of my master bedroom it has just become a dumping ground of clothes and clean clothes and new clothes and pillows and my dog peed on we have two duvets on our bed in the winter time and our dog peed on the top duvet about a week ago so I had to throw on this blue quilt and I just haven't gotten around to fixing it and I feel like today's the day so let's get the bed the sheets changed and I just have piles of things laying around unfortunately our bedroom is right next to the laundry room and our laundry room is not done yet we have not even started it I have some plans on building cabinets and countertop space but until that happens all the clean clothes end up in our room so I'm getting closer to wanting to finish the laundry room but and I got some new clothes from loft and they're just sitting on the chair over there I need to take care of those and hang them up and I have not done a good like deep cleaning in this room in like ever so I want to get that done our bedroom is not finished at all it's just it looks okay but I hope in 2022 I can create a mood board for this room and maybe get it all nice looking it would be really nice I always say I want a nice master oasis a retreat for the end of the day and what happens the master bedroom is always the last to get done so I don't think it will take much to finish this room I think maybe some molding behind the bed and paint and a few pictures and I think that will be fine because we have some nice furniture let's get cleaning and if you need to clean your master bedroom why don't you get up and clean it with me we can do this together are going to start today by taking off the duvet and taking off the sheets as you can see I have lovely snowflake flannel sheets I love flannel sheets in the winter time but we're gonna take all this stuff off I usually clean my sheets about once a week so today was that day that we do that I just recently got a silk pillowcase for my pillow I will say the one I got from Amazon is kind of cheaply made and it's not my favorite. So if you have a good silk pillowcase, can you please let me know in the comments which one you have? But I've heard that it's better for your hair. So we will be putting on a silk pillowcase on my side of the bed. Let's get all our sheets clean in the laundry. As you can see, I did do our sheet protector too. So I'm gonna get that cleaned first so we can get new sheets back on. I have the Dyson vacuum and I honestly haven't played around with my attachments in like the past five years that I've owned one of these vacuums, but I figured this was a good time and it was so handy to be able to do this. I decided I would go all out and really clean the bed really well. So I'm just going to vacuum pretty much the entire bed. You know, your hairs can get stuck on there, dust, and I just wanted to make sure that it was nice and clean. Thank you. 
today I want to share with you this bed spray. It is so easy. I do recommend having good essential oils. I use a combination of cedarwood and lavender. Both of these are relaxing and help with anxiety and they are calming. They both just give you a good night of sleep. So I put about seven drops of each in there and I just filled it up with water. I will spray this on my bed right after I get my sheets in so that it has time to dry. You could also play around with other essential oils. I just like the combination of these two for a good night of sleep, but you could also use things to keep away the dust bunnies. I just recommend a good quality oil. I use Young Living, doTERRA is also another good one. I shake my spray bottle before every use just so that the oils get mixed together. had a treadmill or piece of workout equipment in your room and all the stuff just gets piled on it instead of being used that is what this chair has become it's just so convenient right outside of the bathroom to throw clothes on it so I'm gonna take the time put dirty clothes in the laundry basket put some clean clothes away I also got a few new clothes and so I'm gonna go through those and organize them I do love having this chair in here in the summertime when the fountain is on in the pond. I will push the chair up by the window, open the window, and listen to the water. Our bedroom just has the perfect view and the wonderful sound of the fountain is so relaxing. having blankets in many rooms in my house not only do they keep you warm and cozy but they can act as a beautiful decor piece draping over the side of a chair or a couch We are going to take the time to do some dusting. I always use my Thieves Cleaner to basically clean anything in my house. Again, it's a Young Living product. It is just a small cap full of Thieves essential oil and water. It is just a wonderful solution. I feel like it's safe for my family. I started using it when my kiddos were little and we're just gonna take care of a few things like my necklace. I keep this little jewelry container in my drawer because it is the stuff that I wear most often and my kids usually don't go in there and try to take anything. But we're just gonna take everything off and give it a good dusting. I'm going to do the top and make sure I get the lamp and I will move it and get underneath it too. I'm also gonna clean the fronts and the sides of the dresser. anyone else love vacuuming as much as I do or is it just me? I vacuum multiple times a day. I just love seeing those lines and getting all the dirt picked up. I 
Generally, because our dresser is right next to the bathroom, I tend to put stuff here that either needs to go to the bathroom or has been taken out of the bathroom. So we need to do a good job of clearing this off so that we can get it dusted. And I also need to take care of the items that need to go someplace else. So I will make a quick pile on the floor of things that need to go out of the bedroom. And then I'm gonna take care of the things on the top. I recently got these makeup tools and I'm going to do a video on those soon. I'm excited to try those. They're for cleaning out your makeup brushes. I also got a few little jewelry pieces, some for me and some for my daughter for Christmas. And I picked up some new face wash and some serums every year around my birthday. I feel like I need to get more face wash and oils and serums to help me not look so old. This dresser and our nightstands are from Ikea. If you can't tell, maybe one day I will change out the knobs. It will give it a completely different look, but I love it. It's like a gray wood look. I will link what I can in the description below of any other products that I've used. And this is my priceless reaction when I realized that my husband has an unused drawer on his side that I could have been using for the past year. My sheet protector is done, so I'm gonna get that on and I'm gonna switch to some different sheets this time, some subtle striped ones. I really do like flannel ones in the winter, but I was just feeling the look of these ones today. I like putting my pillows on before my flat sheet so that when I get into the bed and take off the sheets, my pillows don't go flying with them. If you can't tell, I actually do not have a cover on my duvet. I just have a white cover normally, but I was kind of liking the look of the lines and the squares on this, so I just kept it off for now. I'm sure I'll put it back on soon. I really have not done much to our bedroom since we moved in almost a year ago, so I'm just kind of playing around with the pillows and seeing how I like them. I really hope within this next year to make over our bedroom and I will get new pillows then, so for now I'm just using what we have. I decided to head down to my basement where all my decor is and go see what I could find just to add a few new items to our bedroom to make it cozy and relaxing. And I found this glass vase with these LED candles that I will put inside. They're on a timer so it'll be really nice to have them on. And I strategically put them in this spot because you can see this spot from the hallway when you're walking down into the bedroom. I do love having an air freshener in the room and I am switching it out for a company called Era Home Diffusers. I love these, they give great coverage. The smell is phenomenal. I ordered some relaxing, soothing smells and I'm excited to have this in our room. I'm just playing around with a few things I brought up from the basement. I brought a few different fake plants. I do not like real plants because I could not keep them alive. I have four kids, that's enough to keep alive. I also got a gold tray for in front of the TV. I'll put some little candles on there and also it can hold our remote. Someone is loving the blanket that I threw on the bed. I got this one from Amazon. It is really soft and I will link it in the description below.
Thank you for joining me today in our cleaning spree. It was so nice to get everything clean from top to bottom. And now when I get into bed tonight, it'll be cozy with the candles lit and the nice aroma from my era diffuser. And I hope that you got a chance to clean your bedroom too. And I can't wait to see you back here tomorrow.